Familiarize yourself with your workshop. There are special work areas that are defined by painted lines. These show the hazardous zone around certain machines and areas. If you are not working specifically on the machines, you should stay outside the marked area. Study the various warning signs around your workshop. Understand the meaning of the signal word, the colors, the text and the symbols or pictures on each sign. Ask your supervisor if you do not fully understand any part of the sign. Find out where every door, window, and gate is, and whether they are usually open or locked. Plan your escape route, should you need to exit in a hurry. Check for air quality. There should be good ventilation and very little chemical fumes or smell. Locate the extractor fans or ventilation outlets and make sure they aren't obstructed in any way. Locate and observe the use of the exhaust extraction hose, pump, and outlet that's used on the vehicle's exhaust pipes. Check the location and types of fire extinguishers in your workshop. Be sure you know when to use each type and how. Find out where flammable materials are kept and make sure they're stored properly. Check the hoses and fittings on the air compressor for any damage or excessive wear. You have to be particularly careful when troubleshooting air guns. Never pull the trigger while inspecting it. Severe eye damage can result. Find out which liquids will burn or corrode parts, metals, or skin. Identify caustic chemicals and acids associated with activities in your workshop. Be aware that you could be a hazard in the workshop if you don't wear mandatory protective gear when working on hazardous machines. Ask your supervisor for information on any special hazards in your particular workshop and any special avoidance procedures which may apply to you and your working environment.